Hello and welcome to the Listening Posts unboxing channel on YouTube. Today I'm unboxing the Octava, the, the SCC50 uh, single speaker from Technix. Now this sort of fits into a little lifestyle catalog category in the hi-fi industry and commonly stuff in that sort of lifestyle-y thing. Sound dreadful. This sounds really, really good. Uh, from a single speaker with a beautiful curve, and you'll see that, it allows to project, it, it, it enables to project the sound really, really well into a room and create the illusion of a stereo imagery. It uses it, sorry, it uses multiple tweeters and mid-range drivers along with a woofer to create this beautiful sense of space and size. And if it's not quite enough for you, you can add a second one and pair them up. So it's awesome, absolutely awesome as far as being able to fill a, a medium to large space. Okay, so let's have a look. Technics, um, like most Technics products actually, there's an outer sort of shipping carton. Um, it's got um, the Technics and Octa Octava uh, information. There's little cutaways to show the um, colour, and this will be black, along with some scanning information um, for the model and serial number. Opening this, really, really straightforward. I mean, we've got um, standard, standard packing tape. And immediately we get to have a look at the um, significantly better looking full colour box that's inside. And this helps to kind of promote that product and, 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 and again uh, highlight its lifestyle focus uh, with beautiful photo photographs of it in situ and showing the app and other things like that. Now this one as I said is in, in black which means the grill will be black but the top is in an elegant silver. It's the top of the box that starts to imply some of the real features that this product has on board. Um, with Wi-Fi and other streaming, um, it will support internet radio, airplay, Chromecast, um, DLNA output, all of those types of things, all within this relatively simple to use and easy to get the most out of box. There's also an auxiliary input again. We'll have a wee uh, look at that. Now the top, again, is just uh, sellotape closed with big packing tape, so very, very straightforward as far as getting it open. In the top, we see a very comprehensive uh, uh, brochure so, uh, and user manual, along with a warranty card at the back. There is a New Zealand um, a cloverleaf power cord, got a cardboard, and then the unit in its polystyrene packaging. Okay. Moulded to the product. Now getting into the next layer is relatively straightforward. Um, it's just a little bit of sort of packing tape holding closed and an oversized bag. It's that sort of bubble paper bag allowing it to protect it in transit. Lifting it out at this point is very, very easy, obviously. And we get to see for the first time just how sort of elegant the product is. You'll see its shape and curves means that the unit can sit flat on a surface if required, and you know, in the middle of something, or towards the corner, enabling you to sort of place it in, in living rooms or, or kitchen environments quite easily. The unit has a uh, stainless steel top and an LCD display highlighting uh, what input you're on and, and volume and other things like that. Now please hang around for some photographs. I'll, I'll power this one up and you can have a look at uh, what the display looks like. The, uh, it's the array of speakers in this section. Uh, there's a single centralised woofer. There's three tweeters, three mid-range drivers, um, all giving you an array across the unit to ensure that you've got very, very even disbursement of sound in a space. Um, inside, it's got a couple of cool little things too. To preserve the quality that they're trying to achieve from its sonic characteristics, there's even twin power supplies, things that are often reserved for much higher end pieces of electronics, to ensure that there's no crosstalk and other things as, as uh, functions associated with the streaming element doesn't clutter or create noise inside the audio channel so it's wonderful to see even a product of this relatively modest price is implementing some higher-end technology. 
Uh, looking at the back, we see an elegance to it, and this is an extrusion that just gives it a nice little style. It's at the bottom that we see the, where the cloverleaf power cable comes in, along with a 3.5mm analog input. There's an optical digital, and then a network socket. And again, if you've got the opportunity, you should utilise network cabling when you can, although this is remarkably stable on Wi-Fi. There's also a 5 volt USB. Now, this is an input that can be utilised uh, for uh, source playback of, of the compatible files. Um, on the side here, we've got a dimmer button, and that's the ability for it to obviously change the brightness of the display, but also bring up um, different information or menus associated with the operation of the unit. Okay, so there we have it. Technics's SCC50, the Octava sort of multi-room, stereo pairable, certainly excellent single speaker, uh, unboxed here at the Listening Post in Christchurch, New Zealand. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more, subscribe to our channel.